right, uh, through uh, some research and some data, uh, I'd like to propose Enterprise High School uh, Diversity Implementation Plan for 2014-15. Uh, of course, Mr. Rogers uh, is principal, assistant principal, Rick Harrison, and, and Ms. Holly Lane, counselor. Um, areas of need, Enterprise High School, area of need is with students identified by free and reduced lunch. These students, over the course of the past three years, have not, not met AYP. As a result, uh, I have collaborated with Enterprise High School Administration. Um, we're going to create this diversity plan uh, to assist these students academically. This plan will be implemented in 2014-15 uh, academic year. I will create teams to assist the implementation of the, implementation of the plan, as well as um, um, meet with uh, all, do the professional development with all, all teachers as well. Uh, Enterprise High School, some data about uh, where the research uh, has come from. Uh, school specific data for Enterprise High School for the 2011 through 2014 school year are as follows. Uh, population factors identified a total number of 2,069 students. Uh, that included our ninth graders with 559. 10th grade, 540, 11th grade, 508, 12th grade, 462. There were males, uh, about 1,009 males and 1,060 uh, females, so we're pretty balanced. Uh, by race, uh, white, 1,454, black, 490, Hispanic, 125, Asian and Indian did not uh, justify numbers. Uh, students with exceptionalities, Enterprise High School has the following population of students identified with exceptionalities, uh, description of students in our system with exceptionalities, both disabilities and gifts uh, identified are in our entire system, there's 468 total gifted, uh, English speaking language, uh, 87, learning disabled, 256, mental retarded, uh, 22, uh, other health impairments, 27. Autism, 52. And visual impairment, we didn't have any numbers just to show it. Examination of AYP and achievement data. Uh, after reviewing the achievement data for the subgroup reading through the Alabama High School graduation exam data for the school year 2012-13 revealed uh, these strengths. Uh, we met 16 of 17 goals. Participation goals met and was not less than 97% in any subgroup. Uh, in the area of the graduation rate, there was an improvement. The weakness, however, uh, which is why this diversity plan uh, needs to be implemented, um, is analysis of the data indicates the greatest need in the area of free and reduced uh, in reading. Uh, we did not make AYP. For these students, uh, these students uh, identified as free or reduced, uh, many of them live in poverty, and I think this diversity training would would help improve their uh, improve these students. Diversity strategies for Enterprise High School uh, to better meet specific instructional needs for free and reduced subgroup. The following strategies will be implemented at Enterprise High School. Uh, School-wide homework support students will be given 30 minutes at the end of the day to complete homework. Uh, this will provide the students the opportunity to have a teacher provide assistance with homework and ensure that students have had at least one opportunity to complete these assignments. This can be done during our flex block or we can add it to the end of the day. Uh, anytime these students go home, they're not allowed, they don't get to have the opportunity to do homework because they have to put on another hat, end up being babysitters, uh, take caregivers to uh, elderly, and so forth. Uh, keeping the same teacher, poverty students that build long-term relationships with teachers need to stay with those teachers to prevent uh, the need to build a new relationship uh, when possible. Poverty students will have classes for multiple years with the same instructor. Uh, very important thing in ch with children in poverty is developing relationships with their teachers so they end up so they will trust them. Uh, big big issues with trust if they believe that you care about them then now that they end up learning, it's been shown they learn better. Uh, to better uh, diversity strategies for Enterprise High School, also to better uh, meet the specific instructional needs of the free and reduced subgroup, the following strategies will be implemented at Enterprise High School, or should be. Parent training and contact video, teachers will create a short 
Um, 10 to 15 minute video with the resources provided by the school. In the videos, teachers will introduce themselves, describe their classroom, identify needed items, provide contact information, and explain the desire to see all their students succeed. Um, this can be done with VHS. VHS is cheap. Uh, many, of, many times they don't have DVD players at home and they don't have access to the internet. So I think it's important that we, but every, most, just about every home in, in, in the United States has access to a VHS player. Uh, I think this is a personal touch that uh, lets, makes uh, the parents feel that the teachers actually do care about their, their students and their children. Team interventions with parents included. Uh, poverty parents uh, tend to view education as not being a reality for their children. Uh, and poverty parents tend to be apprehensive toward educators. Uh, team interventions will provide an opportunity for school officials to establish the importance of education and remove that apprehension between parents and educators. Very important that, uh, uh, that we get this message across. The video is a good start, but uh, making the parent, those parents understand that, we, that education is an important part of, uh, uh, of their, their student or their child's life. And, and having them improve over their life, uh, education is a big step in doing that. Uh, references from, from my information, uh, of course, were the, from the Alabama uh, Department of Education and uh, pain uh, framework for understanding poverty. Uh, thank you. Good work, good work.